they give a fuck, I'm a gangsta, I'm dirty, dirty. Yeah. Yo, yo, we are back in After Effects and today we'll be creating this AI transition with a secret free AI tool. So let's just get into After Effects and show you how to do this. In my timeline, you can see I have these two clips right here. So to do the AI transition, we need to take like the last frame pick of our first clip and the second clip first frame snapshot. So what I mean by that is go over to the last frame of your first clip and hit Ctrl Alt S in your keyboard and it will bring this file explorer you can like save it wherever you want i'll name it one and save it right here and go over to ACS photoshop just set it to jpeg sequence and just render it it like render really fast because it is just one frame now again go over to your second clip and take the first frame right here you can see this is the first frame right here and in the first frame do the same thing hit ctrl alt s and go over to photoshop and just a jpeg sequence on there and just name it two and render this transition could work with every software it doesn't really have to be after effects only if your editing software has the feature of like exporting one frame in an image format like we did before getting more into the video i just like to give a little shout out to my newest pack opm fx as the name says it comes with bunch of opm style of fx like vhs crt and glitches and distortions for your music video all are drag and drop and simple to use use and the best part is it is going for sale right now so the prices are really low the sale is for a very limited time so if you want to grab it right now i'll link it in the description and in the art card as well but anyways let's just get back into the video now the ai will be using is this right here it is called cling ai and i know what you're thinking why he is not using luma ai and using this like chinese software because luma ai is highly on demand right now it cannot load for free so you have to have a premium account but in case of cling ai it is pretty underrated so everyone could get here and create some transition for free without any like cost you can always buy the premium but we're gonna use free for now uh, once you sign up to cling it will get like a home page like this just go over to ai video and click that and right over here you can see text to video and image to video we're gonna go to image to video for now and upload our image right here so for that you can see we exported both of our last frame and our first frame so i'm gonna drag my last frame right here which is one into here and let it load for a second and now in the box in the right corner you can see a feature called add in frame just enable that and it will instantly allow you to add another in frame so for that we exported another jpeg as you can see so we you're gonna drag this one the second footage jpeg uh, let's just select it from here it is not allowing to like drag and drop for some reason yeah now once you have both of your frame in here you can tweak around with the settings and stuff we're gonna go with standard mode now and you can play around all of these and stuff the length will be five seconds and the video will be one we can bring this up to get more like examples let's just set it to two and it will cost us like 20 credits if you always like run out of credit you can buy their premium if you are like using this a lot or you can like create some new account and get free credits as well that's a little sneaky way that i have but i won't recommend it their ai tool is really great so pay for it bro but anyways we're gonna hit generate for now and let it load it will take a bit while so go outside and touch some grass and come back okay after your video is generated you can see i set it to two so we have this two like ai videos going on let's just see the first one i guess this is a funny one as you can see this is not like a transition for some reason i don't know why ai messed up and it looks like Kanye West at the last i guess this is because we set the type to two and it like messed up if i take a look at my another one we have the transition going on this one as you can see as you can see this is a really perfect transition that we're looking for so we're gonna download this one here to download 
and it will download for free put it right here i created another one just for example as you can see i created another transition right here this is much better than the last one so we can also use this one so let's just download this one as well now head back to your editing software and create a little blank space right here where we can put our like the transition and now you can just drag and drop the transition that we want let's just go with this one and line it up you can even scale it off if you like so something like here maybe lowering down a bit i know what you did last summer then now we have played through you can see our transition is too long to fix that you can always like time ramp your clip so right click on the clip go to time go to time stretch and set it to something like 10 or 20 so it is like pretty fast as you can see and now we can see the transition is pretty fast now right where it ends put your second second clip on the end so something right here and for some reason it exports in 30 fps to fix that go over to your project right click on the ai footage go over to interpolate footage go over to main and set it to 24 so it is on the right frame now you can just bring it up more and it will match perfectly now so now we can see we have a transition like this going on this is widely used right now every other music video and stuff and no so cold like to do this a lot as well if you don't like the watermark you can just like pre-comp your clip pre-comp all of your clip and scale it up and just line it up so the watermark doesn't like interface as you can see you can go into the pre-comp you can add some flashes add like adjustment line and exposure so a simple keyframe on the exposure uh, something like this copy this paste it right here so it like goes like that as you can see and you can also add like an rsmb if you have on like the ai footage to give it a little bit of motion blur now here play through you can see we have this super cool transition going on this is really trendy right now so your client would love it so anyways you can mess around with the prompt and stuff to get different looks as well but that's it for today's video guys if you like this video please consider the like button and also subscribe to my channel for more videos like this i try to provide value on my every single video so i really appreciate it so yeah see you tomorrow peace